The last stop on my tour will be the Caravan Club site in Alderstead Heath, and it's the biggest site I'll be visiting in this county, with 150 pitches, 68 of which are hard standing. New arrivals are well taken care of, with a dedicated bay and hookup, so it doesn't matter if you arrive late. There's a bus stop at the site which will take you to towns including Red Hill, where you can purchase supplies if you don't want to take the motor home. There's plenty of tourist information in a designated building and staff are eager to help. The toilets and showers are well looked after and there's plenty of them. Laundry facilities are available and cost £3 per wash, with tumble drying starting at 70p. The washing up area is also spotless. A motorhome service point also makes for easy waste disposal. Alderstead Heath is family friendly and has a large play area for children to safely let off steam. Dogs are also welcome and there's a range of walks close to the site which will appeal to canine friends and their owners. It's a secure site with access only through a coded barrier so you can feel safe when you leave your van behind for the day. There's also plenty of staff around who can help you onto your pitch and with level pitches it's easy to get on and begin your holiday without any fuss. As with all my tours I wish I could stay longer but before I leave, I wanted to visit the largest vineyard in England. I've really enjoyed exploring Surrey by motorhome and I've been to three really great sites. However, I've decided to end my trip here at Denby's Wine Estate, which is just outside Dorking. I'm hoping that I can stock up on one or two souvenirs, in bottle form of course.